say. I don't even know if she loves me. I never felt this way about a girl before. Blossom! I'm so glad I can meet you here. Yeah, man, no problem. You know, last night was amazing. Yeah, that was all right. <laughs> it was my first time with only one guy. You know, I've been thinking. There's only one thing for a man and woman like us to do now. Dude, right here? The free clinic said one more time and it's not free. Blossom, will you make me the happiest man in the world? I don't even have my stash with me, man. No, that's not what I meant. Blossom, will you marry me? Whoa. Not cool, man. You can't cage a free bird. I'm sorry. But wait! Why? Wait, he just bounced on you? I used to be a total hippie. Hello, <laughs> ladies. Is everything doing okay? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Are you guys ready for your check yet? No. Not okay. yet. Okay. Just let me know. Okay. So, are you excited to see him? Yeah, we've been writing every day for the past three years. You know, I have a man who's a numb too. His name's Dan. He's a lieutenant. Yeah, well, I just really wanted to know that I love him and that I want to marry him. You were supposed to meet him at the fountain today, right? It's the last place I saw him before he left for Vietnam. Where is he? John! It's been so long. You look so different. Well, war has changed me, Blossom. I've changed too. It's Kelly now. Oh, sorry about that, Kelly. John, I have to tell you something. What's that? Three years ago, when you asked me to marry you, I was in a bad place. But I want to tell you, I do love you, and I do want to marry you. Um, about that, like I said, war has changed me a lot, Kelly. And I've met someone. What? Who? This is Lewis. Hi, man. How? They didn't ask, we didn't tell. <sighs> Sorry. I, I can't believe you. John! Don't roll away from me! John! <laughs> <laughs>